Nice thunderclap. Welcome back to Game Bro Station. We're continuing Darksiders 1. Look at our hand gauntlet thing. I see it. And I also see we need an umbrella. Right. But yeah, so last time we cleared out a few demons that were here, and now we're going through this door. A uh, boom. Yep. You think armor like that rusts? Oh, I'd imagine so in reality. I'd imagine it rusts or can. I imagine, like, in uh, Northern European times back then, <laughs> all those silver <coughs> knights and shit. Mm -hmm. Also made of bonds and whatever. Oh, yeah, these assholes. I yeah. wonder if, like, they have to worry about rust. Right. Or if they just say that the devil's just hindering no armor. Like, we don't know what this is. It comes every time it rains. No! Alright, what's the deal with this buddy? He slashes. He has a axe. Does he dash? <laughs> he can, actually. Does he bash? Fuck. Did not mean to get that close to him. Does he clash? Yeah, he also does ice shit, if I f remember. Does he also bash? What? Oh, God! I don't have that yet. That's right. Sh oh. Okay. Does he know Nash? Who's Nash? I ah! You're not invited to the birthday party. Mr. Jerry. I guess not. How the hell do you not know who Nash is? What's wrong with you? There we go. Hey, you killed him. Good for you. That's Hooray. a fatality. Mm. <clears throat> so how much more of this temple do we have to go? Well, we just started. Oh, right, we did. So, so a, a good amount. But yeah, that guy's dead. Super dead. Getting cut in half Ooh, usually does key? that. Yes, it is. Right. <laughs> Because in this temple, the keys are swords. Works for me. Mm-hmm. Wait. Oh, okay, sorry. I thought... Fuck! Well, excellent. You can't get out of it? I forgot oh, there's... Okay. No. I keep forgetting there's a small delay with the, uh... Jump. Just a super small enough one that if I'm too close, I'll die. But, yeah. Anywho. So if I remember right, let's see, where on the map is the red mark? Oh, okay, cool. There's the red mark, so I have to turn this way. Oh, yeah. Shut up, watch. Thank you, Watcher, I knew that. Thanks. Well, at the map, where am I going? Okay, I'm going here. And then as soon as you get out of it, you're <laughs> going here. That is the one sad thing, is that Mark Hamill does a really good job as the Watcher. But only in cutscenes where the Watcher pops up is he effective. Other than that, as a guide, not really that much. He'll randomly pop up and do the over here thing. But, oh! Right, Tiamat didn't... Right. Tiamat's still fighting the... And they disappeared already? Anyway. Tiamat's still fighting the uh, <coughs> Griffin we wrote in on. Where is the... Oh, I think saving. this is a puzzle. The autosave came up, so something. Oh, that right. Okay, I know what I have to do. Third person do? mode. Grab that. Toss it at this asshole. Wait. I love how hey, you're like insulting all the enemies, and it's like they can be <coughs> civilians hanging out, dude. They're just like, it's just another day. You're an asshole. You throw a bomb at him. It's like, oh, you're <laughs> it. oh, it's a dick, dude. Admittedly, yes, this is true. It's just like I was saying before about the yeah. coffee shop thing. Okay. Yeah? It's like most of these demons are just trying to relax, have a good day. It's like, well, we conquered the surface. Uh, you want to go over to IHOPs? It's like, yeah, sure, let's do that. <laughs> and as they're going down over you, they see war come up, and he's like, give me the key. I don't have any go. <laughs> yeah, that really is the case, but, you know. It comes I with just the whole... wanted pancakes! You get none. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, there's no, like... Without, uh, besides the main demons, at least, like, Samael and a few others, there's not really any, like, character moments. They're all just literally kind of fodder. Yeah, they're just pretty much orcs. Yeah, they're pretty much the God of War enemies. You don't really learn anything about- There's, like, no character development with harpies or any of the little Well, they're more animalistic. Fight. Yeah. <laughs> Where these demons <clears throat> are clearly capable of civilized, uh, technology. Yeah. The only one we really have a small conversation before we... Well, one of the ones we have a small conversation with before we kill them is the fucking, uh... Demon that was guarding the, uh... Samael's prison, if you remember. Because he says something very quickly before... 
we kill him and release Samael from that part. Well, I already forgot that. <coughs> it's all good. Yeah, a door. Go through the door. Boop. So in here, there's a ooh, nice. What? Oh wait, that's a booster. Yep, and that's a money. Oh, it's money. Well, I sell it to uh, right, an Vulcan. artifact. Yep. I forgot. I thought that was. I was, I was reminiscing uh, on DMC, and that uh, looked like a uh, health cross piece. Oh yeah, no, it does actually. Now that I think about it. Wee. But yeah, those are apparently we've been getting 500 uh, souls or money or whatever every time we give uh, an Volgrim artifact? an artifact. Yeah. Oh. Which is very helpful, which is how I bought a couple of these things. I need to remember where the hell I need to go. Yeah, I was gonna say there's nothing else in this room. Because you only explore like this side. Unless there's nothing else on the other side. Well, there is, but I don't think I can... Well, sure. let's find out. I I got the boot. No. Oh, right. The wings time out like the Icarus wings. Okay. Can you go through the door on the other side, or did you already do that? Uh, let me try. Let me see. Because the, the door is green on the other side. Yeah. But I guess maybe you already went through it. Oh, oh, that's an upper level thing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, wait. Over here. Oh. Okay. I see. All right. Let me. You remember go back something, do you? Yes, I do. What do you remember, boy? That. Oh. Red crystals. Oh, nice. I think this is a life piece. Life stone acquired. Yep. It's one of the other things they took from uh, Legend of Zelda. That was the only part that... So, like, that's the main door to get the, uh, the Tiamat. Boss. Yeah, the boss, basically. Oh, here we go. Oh, we were already through here. <clears throat> you are correct. Okay, um... Let's see, there's nothing... Alright, let's see. So, on the map, it has that red mark. Do we need to pause? Uh, yeah, let's pause for a quick moment. Alright, so we're back, and we there was these really dark uh, grab things that I didn't see. Because they blended in a little bit. Yeah, you can blame us if you like, folks. We, we weren't being that observant. Yeah. And truth be told, I wasn't really paying attention, so... Ugh, almost fell off that one. Well, do it. Oh, there we go. Alright, so now we... Push that do it. Over. Cool. Now you can push it over there to your right. Actually, no. I think that's the goal. Relative to where? Never mind. You were facing one direction. Now I said right. Yeah. yeah and no, you're like, no, well, I, I, I gotta I, point out, Matt, that you can't tell the difference between left and right right away. So I'm gonna switch angles and say. No, it's actually the Sorry, left. okay. So, go fuck yourself, All right, Matt. Let's I was like, oh, so. oh, okay, I see how it is, Jared. What's in door number... It okay, this is Talking the Talking over me like a little bitch. Oh, right, these assholes are here. Or this asshole, I should say. Oh, right, we discussed that, yeah. He probably just was looking for a cup of coffee, and then I come walking through the door. <laughs> coffee! Not I really. just got off the cell phone with his wife and kids. He's like, hey, honey, how you doing? I should be back around six. Kids doing okay? We get A in the finals? Good, I'm so glad. I can't wait to see them when I go. Oh! You just made them a single parent. Yes. Sick bastard. So before I go through there, I'm just gonna check and see what was on the other side. Oh, right. That thing's blocking the other side. Never mind. You can't bring the ember with you when you climb? No. Hmm. That or I have to go back down and throw the other one at it. I don't remember. Point is, that one's. That well, one actually, that one's gonna do something if I don't knock it out. Oop, there we go. Okay, and here we go. Okay. And now we're in the bottom floor again. Probably in the part of the map that you were saying should be highlighted, but it wasn't. Uh, someone's running away from you. Yep. Uh, no. You brought his body to- You killed George! He had a family, and you took it away from him! You bastard! I will avenge you! I will avenge my friend! Oh, no, now I'm dead. Man, war, you have no compassion at all. 
Yeah. Like I said, if they actually fleshed out these, like, minion demons, then there would be some of that, but no. I feel like there's an indie game out there that kind of did that with. Like, yeah, it's more or less this kind of story, apocalyptic. All the minions are just, like, hired workers who have families <laughs> and shit, and they're just like, well, I'll just do what the boss tells me to do. Oh, mini boss. Ooh. Okay, so that's what we need. Summon Gandalf. He senses trouble ahead. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Oh, we're not the mini boss yet. I just have to beat this up, and we're going to get my favorite side item in the game. For a second, I thought you were going to say get your favorite side duck. Side <laughs> wow. I like Pokemon, Matt, but not that much. It's anyway. Chakram Ninja Star. Thing. Yep. So, like I said, this is basically the wind shuriken of the game, but watch this shit. Yes. Fucking love this thing. And I get, and you can... Crossblade. Uh-huh. Okay. <clears throat> now I just figure that these trophies are oh, there it just is. for the... These trophies are mostly just meant for, like, the developers. <laughs> if you play the story, if, like, of course you're gonna get to a certain point, and you get a trophy for reaching a certain point, it's like, who the hell cares? You're just playing the story. I think these trophies are just to, like, go back to developers and say, okay, for the set number of copies that we sold, a number of players have reached this point. Oh, yeah, no, that's totally what's okay. Excellent. Yeah, I missed completely on that. Boop. Heck, I remember going in college, that was like one of the things brought up in the course. That on Steam, a lot of developers can look at like, loot trophies and see like, okay, what percentage of people who bought this game got this trophy? And they re they released a trophy nice. for, uh, they released a trophy for uh, when you beat the game, usually. Mm -hmm. You can see the percentage of people who actually got that trophy. Exactly. No, it really is, but it's, for me and some others, it's fun to do. Mm. Oh, right, these assholes get ex uh, implemented now. <laughs> Calling all these demons assholes, I'm sorry, I think you're a bit prejudiced, dude. Nah. It's like all demons are assholes. It's like, oh, well, tell that to Dante, and I'm sure he'll be really happy. Oh, with right, half demon. Oh. Well, he's a tiefling, so, you know, well, no, no. possibly. What? Oh god, oh god, uh, yeah, I'm poisoned. Great. You. Fuck you. Yeah, these guys are like demons of, uh, disease or whatever. And you have to get away from the body because they do the whole explosion thing. Time to see where DMC got some of his inspiration. Hmm. That's a fair point, actually. But yeah, no, I've already said this before in that show before about the whole trophy things. I personally find them useless. I mean, yes, they could be bragging rights, but honestly, getting trophies really does not affect the game. Mm -hmm. Like, you don't get extra shit or concept art so much. It's useless to me, and I don't, I don't, I don't care for it. Yeah. Get up here. Oh. Hi, hi, boys. How you doing? Fortunately, it's no Wind Waker boomerang. Very true. Okay, so all right. So what we can do now is, if we ever see a bomb rock attached to one of the crystals, we can activate it by tossing the shuriken at it. Sense. Time to raise this trophy. No, it isn't, because there's one on the back that I forgot about. Let me get oh, this. Shit. That's fine. And obviously, we're looking for a key now, because we can see that eye there. There we go. There it is. That. Okay, now I can raise the trophy. Cool. I mean, not the trophy. <laughs> Talked about achievements and trophies so much, I said it wrong. Now I can raise the statue. Jared loves trophies. Be sure to send him some trophies at 1 800 trophies for Jared.com slash uh, PO Box trophy man. <laughs> yeah, send it there. Okay, now I think we're getting closer to the mini boss, maybe. Sweet, dude. Let's open that door and leave it on a cliffhanger after that. Or wherever we're going. Destroy those pillars! Oh, cool. You don't have to talk to the 
All right, guys, we made a bridge and took us like what? Two seconds <laughs> to be continued. <laughs>